Hello and welcome back, I am Offer of Mercy and this is episode 338 of our Call of Warhammer beginning of the End Times campaign for Wizardland. Don't forget to like, a comment and subscribe if you enjoyed that air content and then really subscribe by pressing that little bell notification so you're notified every single time my content goes live. We're going to get underway with our review of what happened last time. So, we're going a whole massive distance of... Well, I think it was about here, in fact. Yeah, and we got a nice little, um, what would you call it? Nice little desert, sandy battle thing. Wasn't really nice. Nobody likes sand, it's coarse and rough and gets everywhere. Um, so, what we did is we lined up in our standard formation. Let's just go and check on our army. Because this is the one I used. We had, in the front line, we had our Grushbringer cannon, we had our Hellblaster volleygun, and... Oh, we then got over artillery, but we had them flanked by our Thunderous unit. As you can see, one did um, suffer a slight bit of... slight liquor damage, maybe. Possibly. Probably. And, and that was... Just from a charge that we couldn't. Hang on, what have I done there? That was just from a charge from a orc ball. No, it wasn't orc ball. It was orc ball biggins. Yes, yes, it was orc ball biggins. Because, uh, you know, the dwarves and they move back a bit slower than humans, so I misjudged uh, the timing on pulling in them back, which was unfortunate. Initially, after we'd set up, though, after we had the, them flanked by our things, we had our uh, Rico's Republican guards behind them, along with a Leopold dude. Behind those, we then had our Knights of Arrigo. Um, behind... no. no. Behind these, we had our Marksman of Mergiano. And behind... Uh, behind them, we had our Knights of Arrigo. To the left, and the right, we had our Outriders and Pistoliers. And we also split off our Vol Volans Venators and Thorsten Waring as well. To, and had them on each flank as well. Which was alright. I mean, it turned out alright after a bit, to be fair. But we did have to advance. We'd set it all up, spent a bit of time like, and we were just looking in front of us, waiting for the army to appear on once we pressed um, start deployment. Uh, that didn't happen. They deployed up on a hill, which was ultimately useless and pointless because, you know, we have all of the artillery. They didn't have a rock lobber, so they couldn't really do much about it. They needed a rock lobber, to be honest. All old armies need a rock lobber. I think it's got the furthest distance. It can, it's got the longest range in the game. Or, I think. Don't quote me. You might have got the longest range in the tabletop. We shall rout the scum from the field. Or low, by the way. Because I think... The rock lover. Is it the... Ro I'm not sure. I think it's the rock lover that's got the furthest uh, range in the game. In the tabletop game, I mean. I can't remember. I played in. Oh. I want to say 15 plus year. Bloody hell. Um, yeah, so what we did is we then advanced our army up. Uh, we still kept up our formation in the same similar type of manner. But we did actually have to move them all up individually. Well, not individually, um, it's groups. So, which was annoying, you know. Yeah, it is how it is. So you can't really do much about it. And all, but all, I, all us manoeuvring towards the hill did was make them come down towards us. And we then we just had three beats running. We had artillery. We killed their general so early, so early. It was, it was really good. I really enjoyed it. What else was gonna say about it? I mean, we blew them up. We literally blew him up. It was brilliant. I mean, it was such a it was a really nice Christmas present, like a really quick, nice early Christmas present. And brilliant. I say early because I actually recorded it on the day. I think, um, like I'm recording recording this today as well, which is because I'm being a bit behind, so I need to get. I'm not behind. I'm on on the day. If I were behind, I'd be recording um, yesterday's um, video today, weren't I? 
by today I mean the 27th of December 2021 if you didn't know um right so as they were coming down the hill we were just, we were just peppering them with the things um then they charged down a old ball biggins which ran into this thunderous unit just here but we did pull them back half kind of sort of maybe not really um and what happened then is they then got a, a kind of a charge into one of our republican guards i think and they just they just quite quickly routed after that because we'd already killed the general at this point so them charging into like a phal a spear wall not a phalanx same thing really I means spears pointing towards the enemy in a up and downy straight fashion um don't come at me i know it's not a phalanx i'm just i know what con i know what constitutes a phalanx i don't need someone some history buff coming at me we Oh, they need to have shields interlocking. They need to be overlapping each other, and they don't didn't have thirty foot bloody long pikes. That was a pikeman unit. Only the um, Macedonians had those. Blah 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 blah. Less of it. All right. Thank you. So, what else happened in this battle? Not a whole lot to be honest. Because after we killed the general, the, the weaker units such as the goblins and the standard infantry start to rout a lot more. So we they, um, committed our um, general unit to begin um, chasing them down to be honest the archers were a bit of annoy an annoyance we did have to chase them about a bit which is always the case in it really when you're um, facing um, ar armies that you when you don't deal with the archers first and foremost but other than that is there anything else that I can say I mean we did kind of get like stun locked looking at a dude um, stuck on a rock for a bit but other than that nothing else so let's get underway with the episode I'm, I'm, I've been I rambled a bit didn't I Right. At your service. Let's actually just leave him to do the, the thing. We're actually gonna do a siege. Next step up. Black Oak Bodyguard Unit. Oof. Big ass. Oh, he's a legendary commander. Yeah, we're not surprising. He's been around for a long time. Urban planner. A wise choice of man call into a settlement in need of a new structure new structures he revels in construction projects 10% dis 10% discount on construction costs minus 2 squalor nice quite a it's quite a stacked isn't it as I was reading that I was thinking about like a new game that I've been playing called um, the Riven Rail uh, Vargas Vargas I think in fact um, the Riven Realms, and that is so text heavy. It's I said text heavy. It's, it's like a choice novel choice um, RPG kind of mercenary thing. It looks it's really interesting, but it's I, I first got it when I was drunk, and I, I was trying to read it when I was drunk, and that, it, <laughs> I was just like. I downloaded it and I was trying to read it and I was like, my, my attention span was so minute and I, I just couldn't, I couldn't lock in in the game and and like, I, my, my sleeping plan has been horrendous as well. So I was playing it for like all night, I'm still in like the bloody tutorial which is like a separate standalone game about a, um, about a Vargas or a mercenary captain or whatever you want to call them, a tra trader, a merchant type and um, I, I've not even finished that yet and I, I've been playing it. I played it quite a bit. It's quite difficult. I mean, it's quite difficult to do, um, but it's a lot of fun, and it's very, very narrative heavy. Very narrative heavy. So if you enjoy reading a lot, which I do, so it's it's like right up my alley. I'd I'd actually recommend it to you, but do look into it first before you buy it. Make sure it's something that you want because I can't. You don't. Rec I don't reckon it's going to be an, a style that someone who's not willing to um, read that amount it'd be inter interested in it so i'm gonna get i'm gonna never ramble about that i'm gonna get a quick save and then i will see you on that your battle map welcome to the battle map we're gonna start our deployment straight away shuffle you across a bit straight in front of that turn him off turn him turn him off as well but turn to fire there we go let's not go back a bit i don't want to who was the other unit, anyway? Some gobbos. 
couple of archers. We'll be ignoring them. In the Grudge Bringer cannon meant to be dwarf. Dwarf and maid. Yeah, look. It's like enormously long range is only equaled by orc rock lovers. It requires line of sight, blah blah. Grudge Bringer cannon. Oh, that's in. We're in. Already. First, first time. Beautiful. All disease completed, my sire. Gonna move in a uh, Hellboy style volley gun. Hmm. Let's get them on the walls. Move one in. Not do. Have this guy here. This guy here. And then and then and then and then and then. then. Going to advance our Knights of Rodrigo left and right. Cause probably going to probably go into um, encircle them if we can. Let's do the same with our Dwarven brethren. We know that they're going to be doing some kind of thing. All oh, right, these are really close. Let's turn that on. We'll also have barrage fire on. Let's put a bit of speed on this. Are you going to the walls? I'm not entirely sure. Hey. Stay. Let's turn you off. I don't I don't want you firing just yet, in fact. Oh, turn you on. Fire. Let's have all these gears run. Let's turn it down. They should be gone. Come on, my guy. Drafts. Okay, pull that back now. I don't want them getting into a fight. Are you going to get on the wall there? Eh? Yeah. Where is the, the bloody thing? Get here. Yeah, so it's these two in it. It's these two. Boom. Boom. Let's get back over here. I told you. Do as you're told. Get out of it. Never go about. Shoot him. In fact, you just stay there. Beautiful. Orders completed, Come on. Is this. No, that's not it. Is it this one? Where it? Oh, I see. I really would like to be firing some things at them, but they're not uh, firing some cannonballs at these guys. But they're being a bit annoying, and I don't want to move my helmet of gun back onto that until I can not be shooting at them. I guess because all I'd be having is I'm shooting myself. I don't want. To, I don't want to. I don't want to shoot myself. That's not fun. Let's move up our cannon as well though, see if we can have it like here and maybe get it lucky and f be able to fire it over the top of this guy. Let's move up. Let's blast them. Position yourself there, my friend. 
You. Zoom in. Zoom in. Position yourself there. Uh, here we go. Let's get these geezers to run. Been up since like four in the morning uh, today, because I went to sleep at like eight last night. Um, and just because my sleeping pattern has been horrendous lately, but my eyes are like on fire right now, which is really annoying. Because I, I, I felt like I had a really nice slant kit, to be fair. Hey, this guy is just oh, that's a shot and a half. Wait, where are you going? These guys are... Let's run set up. To advance them, then if they're actually, because they're, they're still actually going, aren't they? Oh, you're missing. What are you aiming at? They're like here. You coming through the gates, my friend? Oh, there's some shots. But yeah, my, my super fan's been horrendous. And um, so fi finally, the fact that I've got them, like, if I've got it, like, in a semi okay manner after a bit, is. Really good, but it's also annoying that I'm tired right now, or I think I'm tired. I'm, I, I can't have overslept because I had eight, eight hours sleep. Did I have eight hours? No, I had like ten hours. So I'm not angry why my my ears my ears my eyes are um, a bit dodgy. Let's go over here. We're still miles out. Kitted these guys. Can you hit? Why are you aiming over here? Nice. Can you start shooting? Pew 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 pew. I'll drive them into the ground. This can no longer fire. Might as well just, instead of doing that and risking whatever, might as well just let him. Very well. Just run by. Oh, the send him in. How's it going? They shouldn't be lose. They shouldn't lose to. They shouldn't lose really. Nine, eighteen. So they got far off, but so they, they shouldn't lose if I get the other two in. They should lose fair fair amounts though, but we should be able to out outnumber them basically. Army way. Put a bit of speed on this. Might as well. Can moving. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Nice. Got him trapped now. More glum neck snappers there. Probably gonna win before um we kill these off, aren't we? Watch it unfurl, I guess, or unfold. <sighs> the aesthetic of these Knights of Arrigo is just amazing. I love the Templar aesthetic, man. It's, it's a bit tacky with, like, you know, 
like all the Templar swords that you can get on the market and stuff, don't ever buy one. They're just not worth it. They all look... They're all modernised, like, crap as well, so don't bother getting one. Might as well, if you can get one, one of them Templar swords, might as well be like a Witcher sword or Aragon's Anduil or something like that for a bit for money. Instead of um, one of those Templar ones, plus you won't get the stamp thing that you get, you know, in the um, pommel, pommel head. There we go. Now they're in battle, no need to kill them. Look how many we lost, ouch. Here's what it is. Let's have a look. Help us have a good 170 thing. Nothing else to really look at. We've got a chevron. Yeah, nothing else. Yeah, let's continue and then I'll see you back on that campaign map. Welcome back. Sigma. Victory is yours. I don't need to loot, but Sigma. I'm just going to occupy. Oh, he's, a, he's actually a... He's a terror dude. Damn it. Damn it. I should have, I should have like, executed or something. Either way. Time to cover your ears, because... Uh, hang on. Yep. There we go. Then we'll get that in. Then we'll go back around for the military... Other military buildings. I'm just going to... Destroy all this, so... This is going to get loud. Right then. Well, I mean, this place is very upset with me. I should have exterminated them. What's it all from? 50, yeah, religious persecution. Hmm. Nice. Probably gonna get kicked out of the Arana. That's what I'm saying. Maybe it is what it is, I don't really care that much. At your service. Opening a new trade. At your service. Are you trading? Yes, you are. Anyway. Anyway. Sigma, grant us victory. Ah, yes, Prince Get Handsome's getting himself some birds. Look up, draw weapons. The power Oof. of chaos flows within me. Chaos. There is bloody Pussy. work to be done this day. It's gonna be annoying fighting him. For the empire. Hmm. <sighs> We stand ready to fight. Sigma, grant us victory. Soon everything will come to pass as okay. I desire. We await your command. Light wizard is really good, right? Can you get to my dude? Fought in vain, for all life is merely death postponed. Quickly, men, move up. Figure like that. So it's this army spoke. Shall be done. The faithful shall prosper. Victory or death. Fall I can't get into of Sigma. Whatever. Advancing good old the Sit there. rewards the We're gonna go and have enough fate with the spirit of Sigma within me. This guy right here. At least he ain't got any like big bads. I guess actually these are big bads. But they don't have any like what do you call them? God, what are the what are those, like, machine horse things called? Kit the Chaos Mounts. Skull Crushers. That's what I'm thinking of. At least there aren't any Skull Crushers in this army. Because those things, fuck. They... They go rough and hard, man. This army's still a beast, though, isn't it? He's, he's like a corn army though. There's no range at all. Yeah. Well, I guess whatever. It's the fact that it's all Millie's 
probably to my benefit. So let's give it a quick save. Hang on. Let's turn that on. Six men. Oh, all right, yeah. Turn that, put that on. That, that's the, uh, what is it? The cavalry that I moved in. And that's the General Maximilian with his um, wizards. So that's cool. But yeah, I'm going to get a quick save. And then I'll see you on that battle map. Welcome to the battle map, and we are very favourable right now because we have got pretty. Oh, it's not even, it's not flat, but it's probably the next best thing. We have all the cavalry. We'll have to like maybe surround their general, deal with him somehow, if I can. There we go. That's what we're looking for. Pull them back. Let's group of our archers. Gunners. Move them out of the way. I'm going to move them back a bit more, I think. Alright, everyone's grouped to where I want to be grouped now. So, one, move them back a tad. Just so I can. Oh, I, I could have probably fully stretched them a bit further forward. Doesn't matter. Movers and shakers, movers and shakers. Stretch this. Nice front line there. To be honest, I probably don't have the luxury with the how much infantry they've got. I probably don't have the luxury of actually playing like that. So what I probably want to do is just have this in a big group. There we go. Right, yeah, that's probably what I want to do. Have these back a bit, stretch them as far as we can, not that far back. That'll do. To battle. Move you forward. Who's on the edge? Chaos Warriors. You can fire when you want, but they're not in range yet. You can fire when you want. Yep. You. Move forward, move a general forward. Warriors, how more orders? They're the ones that we want to be targeting with our cavalry, to be honest, if we can get away with it. Avoiding the halberdiers, to be fair. If I'm being 100% honest. Are they, how, how close do these have to be? I wonder. Put them on aggressive stance. Cavalry. They are so close, in fact. Ooh, let's put on that, whatever you call that. Charge the marauders. Who's this? Warriors. Let's charge them in. Let's pause quickly. Hmm. I don't really want to charge in front of these guys too yet, but I kind of probably need to. Let's pull my general out. Let's try and get away with it. It's about as good as we're going to get. For the marauders, in for them, them. The warriors, the warriors. They're charging out at you. Good thing I noticed. General, pull out. You are getting charged as well. Pull out. Let's have a look. Actually, I want you out here. Actually, I'm going to send Blazing Knights after their general unit. That's pretty free as a bird right now. Pause. On pause. I mean, repulse. Warriors. Marauders. Marauders. Okay. 
Turn that off, turn that off. You come up here. That's fine, that's probably gonna work. Okay, let's pull a handgun is back and I'll reorganize them into some place. It's probably a bit more useful. Have I gone and got my yeah, I've gone and got myself charged, and I let's pull them out. What we're gonna do, we're gonna circle around with our general as well. And we're also gonna have him engage the what you calls it what do you call him the general here we go wow they lost a fair bit get back you Outriders, I just need you to reposition yourself. Yeah. You can still fire at someone. No, move out of the way. Who's this? Ignore it. It's, no, not into the halberdiers. Oh, we missed the general. Pull out. Pistoliers. Outriders, sorry. Ooh. Hmm. It's a fairly low trailing arc. I probably need to pull my general out. Let's pull my general out. You know. You know the drill. Turn in. And I'm getting them murdered by not paying attention to them. Who are you? Alright. Oh, You're walking. I've had put defensive on the it. it does what it wants, I guess. Who's this? Chaos. You. Form up here. I want you to charge into the back of those guys. You over here. Let's have a look. Let's go and put these into a position where they're actually useful to me. Take me over here. That's fine, you can carry on with that. You're gonna move a bit faster, move it as in shakers. What happened there? Let's charge in on them. Who's this? That's unfortunate. Okay. I'm gonna move these um, uh, mages around. Let's go back onto here. Their generals just died. That's very good. Jens Venden. Beautiful. Pull our general back out. Back to the mages. Move you there. You. You're moving around as well. Yep. Let's have you. On this hill, that would be fine. Nice. Fact. You're good to stop. I want you to go in and then I want you to go in on the halberdiers, nice. Get out of the way. Okay, you. I'm gonna use my outriders now to do some collection duty. I want my general actually to get a charge going on them. Let's pull them out. Very nice. Let's have a look. Oh, it's gonna be big one. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Let's pull out now. Time to charge them down, ignore them. You know the drill. Fold in. Fold in. Let's get a cheer. Ooh. Ah. Mm, that's good. That was okay. In fact, that's very accurate. <laughs> that's scary accurate. That's scary. 
Where are you going? I'm not sure I'm a lot. Hang on. Get the... Continue. Time to close these down. Not clo close them down. Time to finish them off. So I'm... Wait a second. Oh no! Was that my general? I don't know. But it's probably enough in it. Let's hold. I see some desist. Well, it's, it's not my general, which is good. It's just one of my captains. That'd have been. Oops, that's upsetting though, still. Steel. Still a bit upsetting, isn't it? You never want to, you never want to do that. Oops. I need to press Alt when I'm doing that. Um, ooh, you. Oh yeah. Gonna get them while well, them guys are ignoring me a bit. Hmm. Should probably be enough, I think. Oh, we don't need to get any more. Yeah, we'll end it there. You quit. Yes, really quit. Who killed? So Wilhelmus got killed by friendly fire. Unfortunate. But it is what it is. It is what it is. Let's have a look. Chevrons for the general. We're 156 kills, pretty good. Chevron for the hell was the gun on our 117. 200, no Chevron for the non great cannon, unfortunate. Light Wizards, nice. Got four Chevrons with 194 kills, very nice. If they had a bit longer range, they'd be OP as hell. Chevron for Nice little Lens Sun with 80 kills. Outriders got Chevrons as well with 51 and 74 respectively. Ooh, and an Archer unit got it with 93. Pretty good. How many did you get? 83 and 32. Pretty sweet. No Chevrons for each of you though. So I'm going to leave it there. And um, I'll see you back on that year campaign map. Welcome back. Ooh. That is a nice mom number. Ransom? Yes. There we go, rejected. Oh well. Nice chevrons. Pray Sigma! Victory is yours! There will be no respite while one foe draws breath. Okay. We stand ready to fight. The fight quickly, men. The gods shall judge us. We stand ready to fight. Um, Our cause is them them in. The darkness shall not defeat us. Sigma, grant us Move them in. We await your command. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. Sneezing. Move him. Just move him back in here. Move him in here so we can retrain him. Got a lot of retraining to do. It's not what I wanted. Yeah, we'll do that. Why not? Before I trade increase. Captain of the Riots Guard. Nice. Cruel and cunning. Yeah, that is what it is, isn't it? I don't care. Let's also get these retrained while we can. I can't. Why can't I? Because there's none to retrain, but three turns will be fine. Either way, that is where we're going to end it for today. So. Thank you for joining me once again. I am Offer of Mercia, and this has been episode 338 of our Call of Warhammer beginning of the End Times campaign for Wizardland. Don't forget to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe if you enjoy the content, and then really subscribe by pressing that little bell notification so you're notified every single time my content goes live. Thank you. Signing off.